Now on WSAR's Breakfast Club, it's the Bristol Community College Update. A monthly visit with President Laura Douglas on 1480 WSAR and 95.9 FM. Sponsored by Bristol Community College. Dreams within reach. Visit bristolcc.edu. All right, 846 WSAR 1480 95.9, your only local news radio. And uh, pleased to have along the uh, president of Bristol Community College, uh, Laura Douglas, on this uh, beautiful Monday morning. And some uh, very good news for those of you who live in the Taunton area. Uh, Laura, good morning. How are you? Good morning, Heck. I'm doing fine. I'm having my second cup of coffee. Well, that's it is good. gorgeous out there today, isn't it? It is a gorgeous day, is right. Beautiful day. Finally got some uh, some nice weather. The weekend was good, and we've got good weather for today and also for tomorrow. And you've got some good news for those of you who live in the Silver City, the Taunton area, with a, a brand new Taunton Center. Bristol's a new Taunton Center and located at a place most of us know, and even the, uh, for sure the folks who live in the Taunton area, uh, the Coyle Cassidy High School location. That's right. So when the owners of the Galleria Mall, uh, where we had our, uh, our location before, when the property changed hands, we um, uh, lost our lease and we began our hunt for a new property. And we are so pleased to announce that Coyle Cassidy School uh, will be transformed. That, that school closed last year, uh, will be transformed into our new Taunton location. And uh, it will be an amazing center with a lot of new uh, additions to what we offered before. So that's great news. Great news. And uh, you'll be open for the fall of 2021? Yes, we will. And, uh, you know, one of the great things about this new location is it's on the bus line and it's really just a very short walk from the Taunton Green or downtown Taunton. Uh, and actually most of our students, when we looked at our Taunton student population, uh, and looked at where they lived, uh, most of them were in that central area. So we think it will be super convenient for our Taunton, uh, students and their families to get back and forth to that location. And, uh, we we are going to have uh, we have uh, face to face classes and we have hybrid classes that's half online, half face to face, uh, and we have online classes. So uh, anyone in the Taunton area can can benefit from those. And you know the really cool thing about this facility is that we are going to have great science labs. We've been able to uh, capitalize on the science labs that. Coyle Cassidy used. They're beautiful. They were renovated uh, not too long ago. Uh, and uh, although we are doing some refurbishment at the campus, these labs are just beautiful. And these labs will provide a lot of science courses uh, really to, to provide um, uh, skills for uh, some of the locations there in Taunton, like at the industrial park, where they're looking for people that that uh, have good chemistry and biology and clean room skills. So uh, we hope to be able to do a lot to serve the Taunton community with uh, its industry and business. Mm -hmm. uh, and then the other big news is that we've got the gymnasium and our athletics program uh, will be able to, um, to use that facility for training as well as for competitions. And so basketball uh, for our 2021 <laughs> season just looks amazing to be able to use that gym. That's great. That's good news. You know, and you know, that's certainly part of uh, the educational uh, process and then, and what folks uh, look forward to. You got to have a little bit of that in the mix in addition in to uh, all the great educational opportunities. So this is really bad. This is kind of very good news, isn't it, for the Taunton area? Yes, it is. And, you know, we, we always want to make sure that higher education is within reach. And, you know, one of the challenges of some of our communities is you can't get there from here. So, you know, we, we're in New Bedford because it's difficult to get from New Bedford to Fall River using public transportation. And the same thing with Taunton and the same thing with Attleboro. So our, our campuses, uh, you know, whether it's Attleboro, Taunton, Fall River, or New Bedford, they need to be centrally located so that our our, 
our citizens can access them. And, you know, it's, it's taught and it's not just uh, college courses and college programs. It's also English as a second language, as well as our high set, our high school equivalency program. And our Taunton uh, uh, location has always served an, uh, a growing number of adult education students. So this is, you know, just terrific as well. And the address is 2 Hamilton Street, if people don't know Coyle Cassidy. Right, okay. <laughs> it's a pretty well-known school. I had been there for a lot of years. It was mm -hmm. great, and as you mentioned, it's a great school, uh, obviously. Uh, unfortunately, they had to uh, had to close, uh, and I'm sure a combination of the pandemic and maybe some of the, you know, some, some uh, financial difficulties, that happens, unfortunately. But so, uh, this is great news, and uh, what what's the best way for folks uh, in the Taunton area to go ahead and access more info. Just go to the website. Yep, go to the website, and we have people who will be waiting to help and answer all of your questions. Uh, we have in, we'll have in-person services for registration, but also it can be done online and virtually. Everything is as convenient as ever at Bristol Community College. All right, and the uh, same guidelines as far as the uh, the pandemic as uh, as what uh, what you uh, have at, at of course at the main location in Fall River? We have uh, all of our locations are uh, are uh, open except for Taunton. Taunton is kind of just registration right now. All other locations have classes, but uh, we do require masks while inside, and that's just the one thing we ask when you come to our campuses. Just bring your mask. All right. Excellent. How are you doing? Things are going well? Things are going very well. You know, we are uh, very excited about fall and coming back more in person. It really is wonderful. You know, we're all about people serving people, and it's great to have our, our campuses more lively again. All right. Well, thanks to you for all the great work. Uh, Bristol Community College President Laura Douglas, you have a great week and uh, hopefully a wonderful summer. We'll see you in September. See you in September. Uh, Take care. Right. Take care.